Hello viewers, hope you all are doing great. In continuation to ongoing series of water soluble vitamins on my channel Food Cyto, today I am going to discuss about vitamin B12, the last vitamin of B complex vitamins. Looking at the key features, the scientific name of vitamin B12 is cobalamin. Now the question arises, why it is named so? As it contains cobalt as a metal ion in the center of corin ring. It is the heaviest and the most complex amongst the B group vitamins. The molecular weight is around 1355.4 kilo Dalton. Neither plants nor animals are capable of synthesizing this vitamin, but bacteria have enzymes required for its synthesis. Vitamin B12 is required for the normal functioning of brain, nervous system and formation of red blood cell. Recommended dietary allowance that is RDA of vitamin B12 is 3 microgram per day for both male and female whereas in case of children it varies from 0.5 to 1.5 microgram per day. Among sources we have eggs, milk products, meat especially liver and shellfish. Now let's discuss about its structure. Vitamin B12 is found as hydroxycobalamin in bacteria but it is converted into methylcobalamin and 5-deoxyadenosylcobalamin in the human body. As represented here vitamin B12 consists of cobalt ion that is CO3 plus a corin ring system DMB that is dimethylbenzimidazole and 5-deoxyadenosine. Corin stands for the core component of vitamin B12. A corin ring is a heterocyclic compound and its structure is similar to the porphyrin ring in hemoglobin. The active form of vitamin B12 are methylcobalamin and adenosylcobalamin. Now let's discuss about its biochemical functions. Methylcobalamin and adenosylcobalamin are two coenzymes of vitamin B12 which are involved in the synthesis of amino acids and hemoglobin. Vitamin B12 acts as a coenzyme for two enzymes namely methionine synthase and L-methylmelonyl coenzyme mutase. In addition to that, vitamin B12 also participates in the transfer and rearrangement of methyl group in biochemical reactions. This figure represents the synthesis of methionine via transfer of methyl group from vitamin B12 to homocysteine. Now let's discuss about its deficiency. Deficiency of vitamin B12 results in pernicious anemia and neuropathy. The pernicious anemia is characterized by a number of symptoms as mentioned here. Low hemoglobin levels, decreased number of erythrocytes and neurological manifestations. So that's all about vitamin B12. Stay tuned with Food Cyto for more such concepts and learning in a simplified manner. Or if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you for listening.